The Claremore family's thankful, even in the midst of one of the most difficult times of their lives. News on 6's Alyssa Miller is live with how community support is giving them hope as their son battles cancer. Alyssa. Leanne and Dave, this school parking lot was filled with students yesterday. Everyone holding signs and chanting Dagan Strong as 13-year-old Dagan Briggs soaked up one last day before heading to the hospital to begin chemotherapy. Justice Taiwa School Resource Officer Curtis Brandt came up with the idea. The day started with breakfast with first responders. Dagan was then escorted to school where he was greeted with cheers and given a plaque for his courage. Dagan's parents, Tallery and Steve, say their son was diagnosed with stage 1 B-cell lymphoblastic lymphoma over spring break. Tallery is a teacher in the district and her husband coaches basketball. They say seeing their community give back to them is amazing. It is a very big blessing from God. It's it's almost overwhelming in, in a good way. Yeah, it's just a, just a blessing to have people behind you and appreciate what you do for their kids and support support you know your kid when, when they need when you need them. It feels different. I mean, I know I have always usually been a big deal, but you know, uh, felt really good. Felt no maybe feel that I made. <laughs> told me that I have a lot of people on my side and that a lot of people care enough for me, about me. Dagan tells me he's not afraid and knows that God has the power to do anything. Live in Claremore, Alyssa Miller, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.